This video is on how to change the calibration parameters for some of the functions available in the electronic precision balance and this is the EPB 10K. The steps we'll be covering are going to be the same also for the EPB 6K and EPB 3K and all these models are available on our website at balances.com. So, to get it, our video is going to show you how to configure the auto shutoff, the beep annunciator, and the backlight. So the the auto shutoff default is set to disable. You can configure the EPB digital scale to shut off after no activity in three minutes, five minutes, ten minutes, or you can disable it so it never shuts off at all. The auto shut off is to conserve battery power. The first thing you want to do is turn the EPB 10K on. And the scale will do a performance power up sequence and you'll notice the display is counting down in hexadecimal. So basically all F's, G's, then it goes 4, 3, 2, 1. And once you see six dashes, you want to press the piece count and release. And you'll notice the display will show RD2 0 0.8. And what you want to do is press the zero button several times until we see A off. Or it could also say A3, A5, A10, depending upon what the scale is configured in. Again, the default will be the auto shutoff is off, so you will see A off. And if we want to change this so that the scale shuts off after five minutes of, we'll say, no activity, what you want to do is you want to select the zero button. Uh, I'm sorry. What you want to do is you want to uh, select the unit key button and you'll notice one choice is auto off in three minutes, auto off in five minutes, auto off in ten minutes. So if we want to set it for auto off in five minutes, we'd have A and then the number five. And so we want to confirm this, so we would press the zero key. And then you would see this L on, and you would press the zero key one more time. And your display would go to all dashes and then zero, zero. And now those new functions have been saved. Now, another function is this uh, beep or annunciator that you hear each time when we press a key. So to shut off the annunciator so we don't hear this noise, it's the same similar fashion. What we want to do is we want to power off the scale and then power it on. The scale will go through the power up sequence again or power down sequence. Once we see the six dashes, we want to press the piece, PSC keypad and release. And again, we're going to see the 2RD 0 0.8 and we want to press the zero key and again scroll through the functions that we could select and there's more information in the user manual about what each one of these functions do but for right now we're just interested in showing you how to shut off the beeping noise or the annunciator so we're simply going to um, press the unit key to scroll through let's see no, we don't want to press the unit key. We want to press the zero key. So we're going to press the zero key to scroll through these functions until we actually see B2. And you'll see it says B2 on. And we want to shut it off. So we're going to press now the units key. And you'll see B2 off. And you'll notice there's no noise when I press that units key. If I press it again... I have B2 on and now we hear the annunciation, but we want to shut off the units key. So it's B2 off. And to store this function, we're going to press the zero key again, 
the zero key again and the zero key again and one more time and the scale resets and now when we press any of these buttons we no longer hear the enunciation so the one other item that we wanted to try to uh, demonstrate is the auto backlight you probably can't really see the auto backlight uh, with this light in um, but there is a nice auto backlight here that's on green and if we wanted to turn this off to save battery power say if we're using the scale in the field all the time and we don't want the auto um, backlight on once again we're just going to simply turn the scale on it goes through the power up sequence when we see the six dashes once again we're going to press and release the PSC key and we'll see the 2RD08 so we press the piece key and once again we want to now scroll through the function menu on the available functions by pressing the zero key and this time we're going to be looking for the L uh, it will say L on so we scroll through and there it is it says L on and we want to change this and there's three choices you can always have the backlight on which is L on there's also L space AU and what this is, is the auto light comes on when there's a weight on the platform. And then there's L off, which means the auto light will be off all times. And to save this feature so that the auto light will always be off, once again, we're going to press the zero key several times until we go back to the zero uh, all the dashes and then the balance resets thanks for watching this video if you'd like to purchase the epb you can visit our website at either balances.com or scaleman.com simply put in the search box epb 10k if you like this video please give us a thumbs up or consider subscribing to our channel and youtube will notify you when we add new videos we have additional videos on the EPB 10K, including Electronic Precision Balance EP 10K Overview on the weigh-in functions and features, and also how to calibrate the EPB 10K. We are Precision Weigh-in Balances. We've been selling balances, scales, and weigh-in accessories online since 1995.